hello and I will be reading you the so about the solar system. I might just get um to gravity and orbit. The solar system. A solar system is a star the in the planets plan moons and other space objects that move around the star. Our solar system moves around one star that we call the sun. There are probably billions of other solar systems in the universe. Suns and stars. Stars are huge. Burning balls of gas, we can see thousands of stars in night sky. But the only but one star is in our solar system. That star is the sun. But only the sun is made of gas and dust. The sun is huge. It makes up more more than ninety nine percent of mass or stuff in our solar system or are they made for the stuff that we didn't get pulled into the sun we didn't form them gravity and orbit gravity causes an object to pull other objects toward, toward it, the, it, the force of the pull of the pull depends on the object's size. Depends on the object size. The sun is huge, so the gravity is strong. All the other objects in the solar system are pulled toward the sun. The sun gravity pulls space objects into path. The sun, the path, leads them around the sun. This this path is called an an orbit. An orbit. Okay. Moons moons are different. Moons orbit a planet, so a moon orbits. It's planet while the sun, while the planet orbit the sun orbits the sun. Gallery. The sun is one small part of the gallery. A gallery. Galleries are made dust of dust, gas, and billions of stars. Billions of gal gas gallery galleries spin in the outer space. Some galleries gather in the huge ga gather in the huge group, like star gather in galleries. Our galleries has a hundred billions of stars. From the Earth, all these stars look a bit like a path of simple milk. Our gallery is called the Milky Way. Mercury. Mercury is the closest planet to the sun. Mercury is hard for us to see. It is hidden be, be 
hidden by the sun. Where Mercury has thin atmosphere, there is a little air or or other gases on Mercury. Mercury, the sky is always black. The sky. Is always Mercury is dry, rocky planet. It has huge cliffs and holes called craters. Mercury is freezing cold at night, but in the day, Mercury is very hot. A day on Mercury lasts more than 50 days on Earth. Venus. Venus is second, the second planet from the sun. And Venus is the closest planet to the Earth. Venus and Earth are about the same size. Some people call them sisters or twins. It is scorching, scorching hot on Venus. The air is full of the night and the sky is yellow with strange clouds and lightning. A day on Venus lasts more than 200 days on Earth. Is a planet, the third planet from the sun. The sun. Earth is the only planet with liquid water on the surface. Most of the Earth's Earth's surface is covered by water. It even looks blue. It covers when seen from space. Earth has the right mix of blood, mix of air, water, and warmth of the sun. It makes life possible. Earth, it's home to more than thirty million different forms of life. Mars. Mars is the fourth planet from the sun. This skull is filled with iron. The iron was because of air and of the rust makes the skull look red. The red color gives Mars its nickname, the red planet. Mars many has once looked like Earth. It it's even has water deep in ground. In ground. People want to explore Mars to understand how to the how to planet change. A day on Mars lasts almost as long as a day on Earth. If I can really actually show you the page on Earth. Jupiter. Jupiter is the fifth planet from the sun. It is one of the gas giantest Jupiter is one of the biggest actually I will stop at Jupiter so I hope you enjoy um, the the solar system I will make a part two of this bye guys